tough. It's so tough. There, there was a point where I thought, no, I'm gonna fall over. F45 is the new exercise craze which is sweeping the globe. It all began down under and it's recently arrived in my part of the world. And this week, I'm trying it out. I'm late, I'm late, I'm really late. So this is the thing with me trying to go to exercise classes, especially in the week, because I've been editing until literally six o'clock and the traffic in Bristol at this sort of time is a nightmare. So this is why I always struggle to get to places on time, especially at this end of the day. And I've got to be at F45 in less than 20 minutes. And I think I'm exactly 20 minutes away. But this isn't my first time trying to get fit. About a year ago, I signed up for a gym and I had a few one-off personal training sessions. But as you can tell from this footage, I look exactly the same right now as I did last year. So going to a regular gym didn't really give me the results I wanted. It's not that I didn't like the gym. I've just got too busy for like today, for example. And yeah, I just need something to get back in it. And I could really do with a kickstart. So hopefully this is gonna be that if we get there on time. I got there just about on time, just as the class before me was finishing. They do several classes a day and it's best to get there a little bit earlier because the instructors go through all the different exercises. Each day the workouts alternate between cardio and strength and this day was cardio. The exercises are fairly simple but if you didn't quite remember it from the demonstration then the instructors are on hand to help you out. You do several time sets of an exercise with a short break in between and the aim of the game is to work as hard as possible. How was that? I told you to get there earlier than me because I knew you were going to be late, so it all worked out but, in And my it favor. worked out perfectly because yes, I'm in did. a car parking space right in front of <laughs> F45, which is there. But that was really tough. Like, it was hard. Uh, it was yeah. really, really hard. It was one of them ones where you're just like, just stop, just make it stop, make it stop. And then after, you're like, oh, I could have gone so much harder. So the next time on, I know what to expect. I know yeah. how to pace myself. I know exactly. what I've got to give. Because I was I was confused. I thought there was more... We'd do the three sets of the circuits, like the three mm. full circuits. And I expected there to be more. It went really, really quickly. Because it does. 45 minutes feels like a... Like a 45-minute run feels like forever. 45 minutes of F45... <laughs> doesn't feel that long. Because oh, is that why it's called F45? Yes, obviously that's why it's called F45. Duh. Uh, <laughs> so, I don't know why, but this week I've really struggled to like get the right amount of sleep. Um, I think I went to bed something like 12, 30, 25 to 1, it's now 7.07, 7. I got up at 20 to 7, 10 to 7, that sort of thing, because it's time for another F45. This morning was another cardio workout, and I find that cardio is better for me in the mornings, and you can see that I'm working harder in this session by the colour of my face. Well, there we go, another day of F45 done. How was that one for you? That one was tough. Yeah, that it? one was really tough. I think both cardio sessions I've done have just been a lot. Time for another day of F45. So today's the one that I've been really looking forward to. This is what they call the, the climax of F45. I think that's what they said on the website. Um, so it sounds pretty good, doesn't it? So it's Hollywood Fitness. Well, I don't actually remember the name. It's got Hollywood in it. So I guess that gives you a little bit of an inkling of what to expect. So there's a DJ and it's an hour long and it's a combination of both the strength exercises, which I still haven't done yet, and the cardio stuff, which I've done lots of this week. So, so far, I've been very impressed. Everyone there is really nice. I think the trainers really make it. There's no mirrors, which is interesting. So it's really easy 
just zone in on your own workout, and, and maybe that's why they do it. They do say on the website, there's no mirrors, no mirrors, so it's obviously something that's part of their ethos. Uh, but yeah, great few sessions so far. Looking forward to this Hollywood one with the DJ. Uh, so yeah, I just need to get there on time now because as always, I'm running just a little bit late. Hollywood Day is probably one of the busiest days at F45. It's an absolutely insane combination of the cardio and strength workouts we've been doing through the week. This was the toughest but the most enjoyable day. It was probably because after a few sessions I was comfortable with what I was doing and the DJ definitely helped to keep my energy up. So Saturday was Hollywood Day <laughs> and I think the H in Hollywood stands for hard. And hurt. It was um, brutal. Uh, but the thing is though, no matter how hard it gets, everyone's so happy yeah. when it finishes. Maybe because it's over now, or maybe because we're so rushing with endorphins. But either way, I've never sweated so much in my life. Yeah, but, and everyone always comes back, which is nice as well. So the thing is though, I the thing that I probably need to work on is like maintaining a level because going from exercise to exercise, I was getting really floppy. So you have to have a bit of, you know, general, yeah. you know, I think when I get tired, my coordination just falls right out the window. So trying to get my foot in the little band to do the pull-up bit, oh, I spend most of the 40 yeah. seconds trying to yeah. do that. And I definitely nearly fell over and broke my neck. Paul <laughs> kept coming over and like having to literally lift me into the thing because I just couldn't do it on my own. Um, but yeah, either way, uh, Jamie's getting a good workout this week and I think so is Emily. Yeah. There we go, guys. That was my week here at F45. And as I'm recording this now, I'm in the middle of through my third week, so it's going good, I'm going strong, I'm a bit achy, but I'm still having fun. Now, whilst taking on this F45 one week challenge, I was also dealing with type 1 diabetes, so if you want to find out how that worked with F45, then that's coming up on my YouTube channel very, very soon, so make sure you're subscribed, but whatever you do, like this video, because that's all for me for now, I'll see you in the next one.